We begin tonight with a bizarre police report that's going to make you do a double take. No doubt about that. Cops called after a woman in Murfreesboro says she was sprayed in the face with a restaurant water toy and called it sexual assault. New at 10 tonight, our Jason Lamb looked into this. Jason, this all happened at a hibachi restaurant. Yeah, that's right. And the restaurant says the water toy they were using was just part of their normal act for diners. They say they couldn't believe it when police showed up and filed this report. The folks at Wasabi Japanese Steakhouse in Murfreesboro say along with dinner, Fire's coming. diners yeah, get a show. Them. But now one diner says last night she thinks the cooks here showed a little too much of the little guy in the cook's just hand. Like the hold of water, just like that. Here's a closer look. You hold a side and that push up. So water come out. A plastic toy that yeah. sprays water yeah, made it. to look like the yeah, figure so. is urinating when its toy pants are lowered. Last night at dinner, Wasabi Restaurant admits one of the chefs shot some of the water in the face of one of its customers. It peed on me, basically. It shot water out of its penis. How's that? Out of its wee wee area. Isabel and James Lassiter. Does that make sense? Here on a job from Texas say they were mortified when the chef essentially made the toy urinate water really on Isabel. In front of our minor children and grandchildren. It really didn't have a wiener, but you got the point. They were so upset they even called the police, citing assault. Well, it was a sexual style assault on my wife. Police also noted the doll wasn't, well, anatomically correct. But Isabel and James say that doesn't matter. I mean, that, that, just because it didn't have a wing. Just because somebody may cut off that little piece of plastic to say, okay, it's not there anymore, doesn't change the fact that you're getting peed on. Yeah, I really The general manager, Johnny Huang, yeah, I that. says he apologizes to the family and that he's never had any complaints about the toy before. And the kid like it. He like a, they pay the water, they think just a water gun, kind of like a water gun, you know. But now he says it. chefs yeah, will at wonderful. least ask permission Thank you. before showing more of the toy boy again. So far, no charges have been filed, but the family says they are still considering pressing charges. They say they'll make up their mind over the next couple of days, but we want to hear what you think right now. We have a big conversation going on on my Facebook page. Just go to Facebook and search NC5 Jason Lamb to weigh in. Rory? Jason, thank you.